Here is the video for the uh, larger cabin on Breezy. This is the driveway starting there, going up. It's a real nice, long private driveway. Great parking, which is important when there's a, a high bedroom count cabin. A lot of times they're very poor parking, but this is excellent, one of the better I've seen. Stains and okay shape not great but not bad or terrible either it needs a little bit of work on the where it gets the most sun love the uh copper colored metal roof feels good and private out here quiet until we go inside here you'll see it's got the composite trex like decking Excuse me, sorry. It's got a full size laundry side by side. Most cabins have stackable. A lot of the bedrooms are very similar. This is the main level bedroom. There's one on this level, two upstairs, and two downstairs. They're all, actually, I haven't been downstairs yet, but the ones in the main level and upstairs are very good sized. This has got a private deck off of it. Uh, the bathrooms are all very similar. Nothing real fancy, but definitely acceptable. Shower tub combos with a nice slate look. Tile. And we'll go look at the two-story family room with a really nice stacked stone fireplace. And half bath. Kitchen's got a good countertop space for most ca in comparison to most cabins. Cabinets look good. Fridge has got some dents in the in the stainless steel, but it's not a huge deal. It's just wear and tear you kind of expect, I guess, in rental cabins. So an important thing is uh, on larger cabins to make sure they got enough seating for dining for the number of people it sleeps. So this is a five bedroom, and they've got eight at the table, so that's too short. But there's plenty of room for the bar here where they add another five seats. So it's got adequate seating, which is important for eating. I'm gonna take a look at the deck. Once again, it's got the composite Trex decking that's not gonna need upkeep or maintenance. Staying back here actually looks pretty good. You can see it's a little bit needing some places here, but not, not too bad. And actually the view off the main level bedroom is a little bit better, but you can tell how private it is from here. Kind of capture a mountain through there. And this particular property has a nice cleared out area there, that wouldn't be a bad place to do a, a nice fire pit and really uh, try to maximize rental and wouldn't cost much at all. They had a halfway done one near the front of the driveway. But. So from where you're, I'm at now, I cannot see another property at all. Uh, no roof, probably not even during the, the winter time when the leaves are off the trees. So it's nice and private. Logs, you can see it's got not as much sun. You can see the black on it, but that's easy to deal with. So the decks are accessed off the kitchen or dining area and the main level bedroom. On the main level here, there's no deck access off the family room, it's just a big wall of window, big glass. 
So we'll go upstairs. And once again, a big bedroom. <laughs> Jacuzzi's in the bedroom like I'm used to seeing pretty often. But it does have a true private rest of the bedroom. The closet's kind of tiny in these upstairs bedrooms, but. The other bedroom's pretty much a mirror image of this one. closet real quick which at least it's deep goes back maybe four or five feet just behind the shower and uh, tub combo floor plan is pretty good I think Got all the updated flat screen TVs. This is just a mirror image of the other bedroom, really. The bath. And that's out towards the parking area. Nice blinds. Really didn't seem to need a whole lot of work that I've seen so far. We'll head downstairs. I think they're still cleaning that and sweeping, so beware of the noise. I think I got that at yeah, half bath. Ma'am, yes, do you mind if I come down here now briefly? Yes, All right, thank you. Oh, you're fine. Thanks. Go. Go. Okay. All right, so down here we have dual bunk beds. And another full bath. No, this way. To the, to the bump beds. <laughs> Alright. Foosball. So down here, this could be made into a theater if someone wanted to. They have a uh, pool table here. More so, it's like seating where I'm standing at. Theater screen on that wall. You do a bunch of different things. It's got a big TV here as it is though. And it's got a private deck off the back here. in the hot tub now as they do after every guest and off the other bedroom they have a private deck so this would be a good place to have steps leading down to an outdoor fire pit area, kitchen, something like that. One more bedroom and I'm done. <laughs> Thanks. Okay. One more bedroom and we're done. All right. It's <laughs> so, uh, so another half bath. laminate floor down here and a nice large king size bed down here with a good closet just walk in bigger than most you see in cabins 
It's a little dark in here now just because I don't have the windows blinds are on or the lamps on. Nice furniture throughout really. And uh, we've seen a couple of these before, pretty much the same style bath. So I mean all the bedrooms are real good sized. And that does it.